Kieran, it's live now, so hopefully you should see it. I swear, if you can't see, I'll be so mad. But that is actually good, because that means it's like, if you refresh the page once or twice more, it should eventually just trigger that I'm actually streaming. Oh my god, game. Well, so guys, I've got Kieran with me. He's, he's streaming this, he told me to do this, I just left Liverpool because, you know, he, he wanted to do it, so fuck it, we're doing it. So, um, is there a manager in the game, or not? Yeah, I know, but, but where? Um, can I even pick a championship team? Oh! <gasps> Kieran! How about I do him? Look on your screen. Yeah, let's, not bring him back. let's go, lads. We're bringing the. <laughs> we literally bring him back a flipping gravel dishwasher. The, the, the manager, absolute legend. Here we go. Change. Of course, I'm changing team. You blind. Hundred percent. I'm being this, lads. Right, Kieran. Transfer window on or off? First window. Not on, okay. I thought you could, couldn't you? It's just you couldn't bring anyone else in, unless they're Youth Academy or Prospect or whatever the fuck. I don't know. Here we go, guys. We've started a Burnley career mode. Kieran is going to tell me, he's told me, hold Bellis and Nathan Teller, permanent sign. We don't know who else, but Kieran, you're going to help me, alright? You're going to help. This is going to be the gankest Burnley team. Kieran, we've got a flipping dishwasher. As a manager, he's got he's got a great. Someone should put pebbles in a dishwasher and put it on John Dyke. No one even cares anymore, son. Okay, so are you fighting for this? Yeah. <laughs> no one Fortnite. Fortnite's kind of dying when we're playing FIFA Bunny Career Mode. A warm welcome. Here we go, boys. Um, do we want a pre-season tournament? Do we want one? Alright. Right, Kieran, so, um, no, 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 it's not Stevenage, mate. We, we're not drunk. Right, so... Do we want a pre-season tournament, Karen, or do we not? Uh, yes, yes, do it. Why are these so difficult? I'm in the championship, man. We're not ready for this. No! Well, why don't we keep what we've got? I mean, I'd rather have a season to absolutely deck this squad out, like you don't even know, absolutely deck them out. Stop it. Stop it. Yes, man. Right, what's the best formation? Do they have loads of cams? Do they use loads of cams? Or not? Apparently not. Right, well, Tell is definitely playing. I'm not even going to question the yeah, tell her get out, get in there right now. Has to be. What what do I do? What's the best formation for this team? I don't understand. Uh, yeah, that, that's, that's a good formation. Yeah, but where though? Because I need I need another cam at least. He's like really old, isn't he? Yeah. Oh my god. Is he, is he real life? Is he good? Who have we got? Uh, Roberts? Yeah, Roberts, you're not really going to me. There we go. See, so we've got Vitinho, got Matson, I like. It's coming together, it's coming together. The process. Is there a 
You know what? I'm doing this one formation. I'm kind of excited for this. That one. What do you think does that mean? Yeah, what does picky jack of football mean? Quick maps! Right, okay, well, first I need to sort out. Right, you know what, Youth Academy? I know it's going to be crap because for some reason this game I never got my youth player. Yeah, no, absolutely no. Get out, just leave the team. You're not doing it. But there's one thing I'm going to do. Could be good. Right, Kieran. So if I look at this team, see, what is that? I know, but I'm trying to fig I just figure out this team at the moment. I'm so lost. I keep Muir it. Oh, I, uh, man, this team is a bloody shambles. I need to find out who's playing, who ain't. I don't even know. Right. Well, get rid of Franchi. He's going. Get rid of Peacock Farrell. Murich is definitely starting because of his racing. He has to start. I, I cannot let him not start. He has to start. So he's definitely playing. Change kit number to number one. He's going to be our number one. He. Kevin, I'm going to Jesus! There we go! Oh, are you fucking joking? Are you kidding me? What? That's good then, mate! It's got me some random. Yeah, go to Goodmanson. I want to Goodmanson, dude. I'm at 4.8 in Goodmanson. No. I'm fine. Fine. You take your money. Do that. I don't care. I want Matson to go back. It looks good, doesn't he? Well, I mean, since he might quite. I think I have to use all my money on literally just getting these people in. This is kind of, kind of sad. Go so baseball, go so baseball, yeah! Okay, so he's definitely saying no matter what in the universe, he's definitely in this club, right? See, that's what I like. Young player, good overall, absolutely boss potential. That is what I like. Matson, hello. You are going to become a left wing back, my friend. Right, do we want Dogson? No, we don't want dogging, man. All right. Honestly, I don't even care. I'm definitely keeping him. I I'm not going. I'm not going for him. Luke McNally. Uh, we are gonna have no money left. Like, do I even buy buyer? Charlie Taylor. I guess I'll buy, I don't know, Kieran, do I buy buyer on loan? Like, buy, buy him permanent? Because, like, I feel like we'd have, like, literally no money left if I do actually go in and buy him permanently. We'd have no... Fine, you know what, let's just get it done with. Delegate to buy, sod it. There you go, you can have a look, Kim. Well, Al Dekeel. So, hold the balance, yeah, please, please go to him. 
Wait, what was he? Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm definitely buying him. No, no chance am I not buying him. The team you only want to keep, don't we? There you go, you're staying. Who? He looks good, doesn't he? Egan Riley. Yeah. Yeah, what's his potential, bro? Alright. Yeah, get rid of Cork, man. He's way too. He's way. No, 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 no. It's got twine got good potential, tell me please. Okay, well definitely Zarawi's got good potential apparently. Well it's about enough in it, that's still quite good. Ugh. Kieran, do you reckon there's any free agents that'll be godly? Hey, yeah, well, ba Bastion, probably not, don't we? We definitely don't want Bastion. Um, yeah, yeah, you're, you're rubbish. Goodmanson can go. Yeah, guys, is it alright if I do a club clear out or will that kind of ruin the career mode? Um, well, yeah, because the players could get unhappy, they might affect the manager rating if you don't play your own youth players. Do I get rid of Manuel? Yeah, probably. Um... <laughs> You know what, I'll put on a development plan just to see how he does and then if he comes in with an offer I'll I'll I'll, I'll cash him in on him. Yeah, we get right, what's Teller's potential? Tell me now. Yeah there we go. Good, he's had this career mode to kick off. Okay, and I need players, I need actual signings. I'm gonna get some free agents. Got any suggestions? What what positions do we need to focus on straight away and I'll look for some free So is he just back up or is he gonna be our permanent striker? No. No, 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 no. Oh, God, no. I'd rather get rid of or I'd rather just cash in on him. I ain't bloody having him. Jay Rodriguez. Is Dervis our glue? Is he got potential? Yeah, we need some strike. Is Lyle Foster any good or? So basically, we need to look at like a crap ton of strikers. <laughs> yeah, we we we're doomed. We're actually doomed. We're actually doomed. What? Well, you know what I'm gonna do, Karen. I'm gonna get youth staff, and I'm gonna send them out look for some strikers.
Okay, run. Any other positions I should send out, or should I just leave it as it is before we get before we get into actual trying to buy actual players? Because we have like absolutely, we need to sort this team out badly. Well, I think I think strikers first. I mean, bloody normal. I mean, are you kidding me? Right. Yeah. La, la, la. All right then. Kevin. Right, Kieran. We need to like crunch. We need to hope. So, first position. Should we look for some strikers or a midfielder or what? I'll look for a striker first, see if there's any good ones. Yes, no, free agent! Oh, Booth and Booth out! Can you look at Osman Bukhari and see if he's like, worth our time? Right yeah, but is he got potential? Come on, there's gotta be so okay, it's not Alright, okay, I think after that horrendous thing, let's look at some centre backs. Let's look at let's see some defenders. Nah, but probably I don't know if I'm that busted Mexican centre back. That'd be funny. I don't think I will, but it'd be funny. Uh <laughs> well, he ain't, because he's not got the best stats in the world. Like, he, he really tell me that's going to be like 70 odd rated. I don't know why they made that a thing, but alright. Yeah, Come on, we want more people, bro. Gotta be more people. There has to be more than this. There has to be. Oh. <laughs> okay. I think you know where we're going with him. We remember this man. Remember this absolute stud of a play. This guy was a stud. This guy was an absolute stud in our team. Yeah, he's, he's needed, isn't he? He's needed. So, Kieran, do you actually think we're going to do good in this career mode? Yeah, I think you get fast, yeah. Right, so, we've got, so this guy's going to be a stud, isn't he? What's his overall? Can you just Google what is his... No, no, no. No, not overall, meant potential. Like, what can he... Yeah, what can he grow to, though? Like, that's what I want to know. Like, I want to make... I reckon it might be. I reckon if you know play him enough, he, he might become a pretty pretty solid player. Definitely block. Definitely right wing. Okay, we need some centre mids. Um, oh yeah, I could look at some free agents, see if we've got uh, any free agent mids. Uh, well, I guess I could have a look. Yeah guys, this will be definitely the long part of the career mode where we're literally just making all the rubbish first, then all the rubbish is done. We get into training, and then it's our pre-season tournament, which I'm very hopeful he What is worth it? Hmm. 
You can play a centre mid, but will he actually convert quick enough to be a centre mid? No, 30 weeks, fuck that. I'm, I'm not winning 30 weeks for that. Mm -mm. Oh no no. Oh no no. How many no? Right. Okay, I think we should do this, yeah? yeah. So, uh, who do you reckon we'll find? Do you reckon we'll find any absolute goats? No, it was sent to me. That's what I'm looking for, bro. Um, I like Garbit. Um, yeah, but is he, like, got any potential or is he just stuck where he is? Come on, where was that? Uh, I'm a bit disappointed with these free agent guys. None of them are really that good, and it kind of worries me. Yeah, but do they have, like, any potential? I don't have cams, so... So if I got Louis Romo... You know what, I'll get... For you, Kieran, I'll get Romo. Yeah, I'll pick Romo. It's just our little centre mid to be great. Because he's needed. Oh, for God's sake. For God's sake. No. No. Nah. Wage 20k a week. Because to be fair, I'm not spending. Here, like we don't have any cash, bro. We need like people. No, no. we well, can always get him back, Karen. Don't worry. We, we can always do that. Only train. It's not always the only train. Yeah, yeah. Dream on, mate. I'm not. I'm not skipping every train draw. You know how busted your team bees after train draws. It's so good. Well, it is because you know I'm using the the club that you enjoy. I'm I'm enjoying this far, aren't you? Yeah, really good so far. Building the team up, aren't we, for the future? So predictions, for predictions for what? Uh, like the season, I, think I reckon uh, I I think our team with you know that one or two signings for um could polish the team out, and we could uh, probably so I'd say definitely secure. Playoffs at minimum, but I strongly feel like we should be pushing, if not, should most likely get guaranteed promotion. Um, most definitely, my friend. I mean, if I enjoy it and don't over... Like, if I don't overindulge in, like, 500 signings in, like, the first window, then yes, I will 100% I will 100% be looking to carry on with career mode because you want to see it and to be fair I'm, I'm down for it I'm more than down for this so yeah Kieran keep keep uh, pretend it's my press coverage gotta keep asking questions <laughs> well I mean half the lads were already here but they were on loan so I just tried to you know I splashed a bit of our cash trying to bring them in permanently because I feel like a very good prospects for the future and would do service very well for right now so yeah um alvarez phenomenal free person can't believe he's a free agent very lucky for that kind of pickup um proud of that um and i think we should hopefully do well and um we're not looking to maybe if we get a couple of players and get rid of half the deadwood at the club maybe we could bring in some like really special players like maybe just one or two more I'd say probably one or two more. Like, if we don't find anyone good that we want to buy right now, I feel like definitely 
free agent slash youth from our youth ground. Maybe they'll be it, but apart from that, not really too many more people. I'd say a bit of defense, a bit of both, really. We want to make sure we um, are very defensive, keep the ball very well, and uh, block out all the goals. But at the same time, we want to dish out the pain and uh, really get just score plenty upon plenty of goals. I mean, I hope so. I mean, I just left for Everton, and like you know, I just magically come back. Don't know how I did that, but I did so. Hope they're giving me the warm welcome and I can, uh, you know. Um, pretty much get Premier League regular, some regular, be, be in the Premier League regularly and, uh, you know, maybe make some after a couple seasons. Maybe we're ready to break into European football and become, eventually, maybe one of the best clubs in the, in the world. But I don't feel right now we're ready to be the best club in the world. But I feel like we can definitely. But first goal is guarantee getting to the Premier League this season. That is our number one priority right now. It has to be. Like, it must be. I hope you enjoy it as well. So keep asking me questions, man. I don't want the questions to end. I love answering them like a big press conference. Oh, hold Bellis's purchase agreement. Let's go. Well, because you know, I just had that special place in my heart for Burnley due to being two games ago. Um, making that career mode you laughed your head off at, and uh, you know, something put me back, and uh, you know, I decided to just hop onto it because I thought Liverpool. I'll wait till next season, see what they do with their transfers in real life, and then. Make the squad up from there because having a CDM centre mid and a cam on the bench really just concerns me, and it's just it's just way too much. So yeah, I I think I'll leave that crumb definitely to the next FIFA, and you know it's a real life. It's all out what they're doing. But yeah, and fun. Um, well, if that is possible, then uh, I'm definitely more than willing to try to do that because then that'd be quite good. Yep, turf more biggest in the world. It's going to have like five hundred thousand people. Considering you know we're going to get non stop grid. We have to might have not much budget in the season, but we're going to make so many people be able to buy tickets. And uh, the fans all uh, all the money from the fans we reinvested straight into our players and um, slash the ground and just everything back into Burnley Football Club. Well, you know, I'm happy to do fans, and um, I mean, I'm okay with it at the minute, but I suppose since it's the new era at Burnley, now I'm back, I think, yeah, I suppose maybe it could be in need for a dire need of decoration. It was Bath. No, it wasn't. It's was Bath. Yeah, it's how yesterday. I don't know. I think I think the, the the team. I think it just does that sometimes. I think it just randomly does that. Well, in real life, I mean, I'd be boring permanently because in real life, he is absolutely kidding it. So. Hopefully this career mode he will be the same and he will kill it for us and we'll have a phenomenal, phenomenal season with him. Yeah, very well. Ready for that first game of the of the campaign, which will be against uh, Levante or whatever the first game in our, for some reason, only three game pre-season tournament because I don't know what FIFA have done to pre-season tournaments, but... <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, 
Well, the carrots go keep banging on and on. You know what I mean? Kieran, what's your chant for Burnley or the Clarets? This grey mode. Um, I don't know. So, what are your hopes for this career mode? Do you think we're going to absolutely storm everything or are we going to struggle? Awesome. Well, it's red ghost. How? How is he this bad? He's worse than Nunes at this point. <laughs> He has the he's open goal, nothing stopping him, yet he just literally cannot find the back of the net at all. Even the guy that's legendary and known for misses has been outplayed. Yeah. Even though it's training drill and absolutely no pressure on the players, but no wonder he's on the transfer list if they can't even score the simplest of goals. I mean, it happens in real life, but like, what? I'm just saying, I know Pitt plays miss in real life, but even not as bad as this. Even actually, Barnes is absolutely just destroying everything. Okay, I know we've got Brown Hill as an offer. We've got, we've got money coming in. Yes, we, that's what we need, isn't it? Cash for the rebuild. We just have to. Do you reckon our youth players will be good when our scouts come back? Well, hopefully. I mean, obviously, I really, really hope so. Because, I mean, I did send them out. So, hopefully, they do reap in some absolutely gem of a player. So how many players, Kieran, do you think will be ref to the original Burnley team by the end of uh, season one? Oh, um, I think one part of them so you think only about three or four players will survive the entire season? Yeah, probably our, is he you know, our best player then, essentially, potential-wise? Is he our best player, potential-wise then? Who ever thought that, huh? Our full back was our best player potential wise. So, okay, Kieran, what striker should we get? Because we like for the season, we're going to have to get a, a god striker. We're going to need one. Right, how much is he to start with? Because I feel like we definitely may not have the funds to bring in such a classy player. But, you know, we'll see what we can scramble together. If that's what the Burnley fans uh, do. Yep, the fans are screaming me Coco, Coco, Popmo. So I, I think it is, it's, we have to, you know... Never spend money for the next like ten years to afford this man. 
It's 30 million. That's more doable than I expected to be. It was in potential, by the way. What? Yeah, yeah, we're buying him. We, you know, he, he yeah, yeah, Matson, you thought you were good. Now see Coco Moo Coco Mo. And then see what happens. There we go. Howard Bellis has accepted his offer. We don't have the money to bring him in. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Kieran, we literally can't afford this player. <laughs> Are you kidding me? We don't have any money. That's not good. That is not good. That's actually that's actually really not good. Actually, that's that's really bad. Yeah, we need to we need to sell people like really really goddamn quick. Yeah. Like that's not a joke. We really have to be doing it very fast because I'm assuming you can't just go in for it again, can't you? At some point. I was gonna say, I hope, I hope it's not like, you know what I mean? I hope we're not just gonna sit there and end up absolutely, you know, just botch the entire thing and Howard Bellis never becomes our player permanently. Sick god. Sick god. Kieran, do you reckon Bayer's a good player to keep or is he not good? Hey. Is Bayer our centre back? Is he good to get on loan or should I just sacrifice him? To get Harwood Bellis first. Is Harwood Bellis been good for Burnley in real life or has he been trash? Yeah, this drill is absolutely above and beyond. Just an absolute joke how hard this is. It, is so, it makes no sense. Who decided this was a good idea? It's awful, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's shambolic. He's actually shambolic. Like, who, who did that? That was, that was an amazing finish. Jesus. Did you just see that? Yeah, that's like that is definitely. Yeah, unrealistic. <laughs> no, no, I think Tay Ta Ta just. I think Teller just had the worst miss of all time. Oh my god, Teller, you rubbish. Stop missing. You're gonna get sold in a minute. You're not having your gravy and chips. How did that not go in? Porsche? We have a car playing football for us? What the hell? That's, that's not the Burnley way. We don't just hire inanimate objects and make them play footy for us. Well, we can't buy chairs because we don't have cams. Kieran, he's a cam, but we don't have a cam. We are unable to sign cams. Same with Garby. No, if he's got good potential, I'll look into it, but I'm not buying a goddamn chair. Yeah, we, we suck. We, 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 we do need a little bit of a squad. Kieran, if I do that, I will lose points. And I don't want to do that. Well, so I tackle my lose a thousand points. I ain't doing that. Um, um... Oh, for fuck's sake, are you kidding me? Why is this so much easier now? What is with this game? Kieran gives me... Kieran gives me one fudging button to press, and instantly the drill becomes from really annoying to actually piss easy. Hang on, what? No. Yeah, we did this drill. I ain't doing that again. We did this. What the fuck, man? We did this. Brown Hill's gone. Let's go. Did you see that? He's gone. Here, we're getting money. Money's coming into the club. Oh, 
We might actually be able to do stuff, you know what I mean? Who? Oh. Kieran, we got in. We, we officially have got Harwood Bellis, I think. I swear, if you say bloody chair again. <sighs> Hi, Daddy. Huh? Percent offers, yes. I know, game. I cannot do buyer. I can't do it. What are you talking about? We don't have money. We are. Wait, Kieran, did I buy Romo? No, yeah, yeah, you're shit, you stupid fuck. Uh, why would you reject the Burnley project? Would you reject the Burnley project? Uh, no, Karen, it's, it's just the process, isn't it? Trust the process. Sean Dyke will bring absolute domination to the Dutchman Room of Burnley. Stick with him, play your football. Guarantee you'll be lifting the Champions League trophy in a few seasons' time. Big balls. Karen, excuse me, you have big balls, I know that. <laughs> Kieran's got ginormous balls, everyone. <laughs> oh, yeah, go, guys, if you're playing Stevenage, it's an easy win. Because the players are literally just drunk on the pitch. I mean, I literally watched Kieran's team, who's in the crow mode, and literally they just fell in circles. They they were actually so shit at football. They I don't even know, I don't think they could even see properly because I had a night of all benders before the for the game. So if you ever play Stevenage, you instantly win because Stevenage are just drunk. They're literally just drunk. So 100% you should win. So it says, but don't worry, you know you, you won't lose. You literally cannot lose to them. Just say the word. Well, I'm happy. I'm happy we might sell Red Horse because we need some money, don't we? Like we desperately need loads of cash coming in. Yep. Fine, you twit. I know I was doing that the entire drill. Which is that last one to paint? That was what? Oh my god! What a goal! What a goal from him! That was that was the <laughs> Veg horse. Yo, tell you what, Veg horse. You score. You score a bicycle kick right now, and I will not sell you. I will play you. There's your offer, mate. There's your offer. You score a bicycle kick right now. And I will play you. Told you. Well, of course, I won't sell you, and I will fully play you for a season if you score. A, if you score a bicycle kick, you don't score one. That's it. You're not getting played. You're getting sold straight away. You score one, you'll be in my team, guaranteed. You will be in that starting eleven, pretty much. So there's your offer. Well, of course, score a bicycle kick. You you stay. Don't you leave. You you, you just leave. No, no. Oh, we have inbox. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. What have we got? Howard Bellis. You're very welcome, Howard Bellis. You're very welcome. Oh, dear, bad. We have a trans. What? You can't get drunk on stream. Excuse me. You can't do that. You can't do that. You're getting drunk on stream. You can't do that. You just can't do that. You can't, do that. You can't get drunk on stream. That's not good for the viewers. The YouTube kids could be watching this. You can't get drunk on stream. That's not a good thing to do. What? 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 What the fuck is Eurovision? I don't know what you're talking about playing football. We ain't just see. 
because I don't like him, mate. I've never followed this, so why the fuck would I know what it is? I play this with football. A lot of people just a bunch of people singing, like a, making a twat of themselves. So why the fuck would I want to know what it is? I don't care. I'm, I'm all about the football. Trust the process. Sean Dyke just come back to Burnley. He got a good offer. Like, he got a packet of crisps and he said, he, I told you. We gave Sean Dyke a packet of crisps and he just came back to Burnley. That's all it took for him to come back to Burnley. Nice packet of crisps on the sidewalk. And then when he came back to Burnley, we got to trust the process. We, we, can't, we can't stop for anything. That's some shitty Eurovision. Like, you know what I mean, son? We, you know, we can't be sitting there watching people make a pass of themselves, seeing like dickheads. We've got to sit here, trust the process, and have a good game of football. That's what we've got to do. And that's what I'm going to do. These group of players are absolutely stunning, and I'm excited to see the future they hold for this club. Fuck Eurovision. It's a... Boop, 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 boop. So people, don't watch Eurovision, they're just a bunch of prats. They're just people making a fool of themselves. What the fuck are you doing watching that? It's garbage. Absolute garbage. What is it? It's Eurovision. They're making people throw up. It's absolutely shit. you got to like the process of Burnley. Burnley Football Club, what's the process? That's good of it. Look at this training drill. We're already turning the lads around. Yeah, here we go. I apparently see this in fucking Eurovision how the fuck that's happened. I don't even know. But it happens. So we've got to make them proud by playing Burnley Football Club and show them how. Well, how... Basically, what I'm trying to say is, is that they just got me into different nations. You know, so, so I'm not nation, so I'm like, civilian. Like, see what I mean? What's the point of going to fucking school and learning about nations? You play a game of FIFA and you know all the nations in the world. Absolutely stunning game of football. <laughs> Yeah, who the fuck knows what geography is? Who the fuck wants to know how you make a desert mountain? Who the fuck cares? Just play FIFA, and you learn all the you learn all the nations you're possibly gonna need. Why would you need geography lessons? Just play FIFA. You know half the nations in the world. You're done. Goodbye. See what I mean? Schools. Hear yeah, that? Just suck my ass. Suck my squeegee. I don't give a shit. Just post game of FIFA in lesson, and believe me, they'll come out there straight away knowing every single thing. You know. Much more than only how the fuck a desert formations forms. Who the fuck gives a shit about that? I, mean, I, anyway. I don't even fucking know. Unless you're an archaeologist or some shit. Who the fuck wants to know that? Know, subject, right, anyway, Burnley... What? Am I the only one that's a little scared now, but that's going to reset to, like, day one? What, hmm. Well, again, you can, if my game is froze, what do you think's happened? I'm a little bit scared, but if I close the game... I am, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to see. I'm going to wait until that goes. I won't care if I have to sit here three hours and back loading the screen. I'm not losing all that progress. I'm not doing it. Uh, so, Kieran, what should we talk about then while we wait for FIFA? Because I'm, I'm, I'm not doing it. No, fuck off about that bullshit. It's fucking Eurovision. People are making twats of themselves. Who the fuck cares about that? I don't care about this at all. Garbage. It is shit. I don't know what the fuck you're doing. Draw them all that garbage. It's absolutely garbage. Yep. You decide to turn your life around by starting a business selling food you can't Yep, I like it. So, Kieran, what do we do about FIFA? What the fuck do I do? Because I'm a bit scared now. I'm a little bit scared. Already went 
fight on it. No! Well, I mean, he was wrong. I am Ben Brooks homeless now, but we're gonna turn that around. Did not like but if you believe in homeless trainer, okay? Say that he won't train like it. I'm watching a YouTuber called Craner. I'm watching a YouTuber called Craner. Deliver food, fill the trash can, then find food. 